Hello! It's been a while since I've done a haul type video, and uh, that's, that's what this is. I have actually been slacking on my Etsy purchases lately, um, mainly because I'm cheap. But this past month, I have decided to treat myself. So first up is this top. The tag says CTME. I'm pretty sure it's from the 90s. And quite honestly, if you showed me this a few years ago before I did vintage style, I would think that I was crazy and that it was really ugly. <laughs> But you know what? You gotta see through the judgment and realize the potential of things. That's your life advice from me. I can see how some people would think this is ugly, but I don't. And I think it looks really, really cute and folky when you pair it with a skirt. So judge all you want, but I love my ugly shirt. Don't listen to them. I've got a ring that you can't ring oh, hello. Next up is this amazing corduroy skirt. A lot of the times I like to mix eras, so I thought this was the perfect 70s skirt to pair with some of my maybe 40s or 50s things. I know, it doesn't make a lot of sense. Style doesn't need to have a formula, it just needs to make you happy. Man, I feel like I'm doing a TED talk. <laughs> and it is by Bobby Brown. Bobby? Just kidding. Bobby Brooks. You'll notice a lot of this stuff is very autumn-ish, um, and that's because it's late August, and in my eyes, it's already fall. And if you don't agree with me, I don't care. So you can just keep your attitude, and I'll be browsing the Halloween section at Michael's. Happily. Next up. It is a wool skirt. It is absolutely beautiful. I love when skirts have a definitive weight to them because when you walk around, it swooshes and you feel like a badass. Next up is a skirt that I actually got for my Evie from the Mummy cosplay. I absolutely loved wearing this skirt. The length is really, really nice and it swishes. I'm a simple girl. I just like my skirts to swish when I walk. The tag says Mondi. And on the subject of my Eevee cosplay is this pair of clip-on earrings. And notice I said clip-on because these ears are now impenetrable. These were a little bit expensive, but I'm kind of a perfectionist when it comes to details in cosplay, and these were very similar to hers. So I, I just did it. Sometimes you just gotta do it. And unfortunately, as nice as they look, they squeezed the soul right out of my earlobes. Next up is this amazing dirndl, and I love it so. And there is just something about them that I find so, so beautiful, and it makes me feel a little bit connected to my German heritage. And I know it seems ridiculous to a lot of people that I don't wear it with the blouse and the apron, like it's traditionally worn to festivals and other occasions, but I just it's so pretty! And I think it would almost seem more costumey if I were to wear it with the full blouse and apron. Um, I just think that they're so well made and so thick and beautiful that I wouldn't want it to seem like I was wearing a costume. Next up, these are not vintage items, but they're something that I am very excited for, and it is my first purchases from this lovely lady that I've been following for a very long time, and I don't want to botch the name. I think it's either Femme de Bloom or Femme de Bloom. 
thumb. 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 Okay, so I'm gonna say them. 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 I finally purchased some beautiful things from her. Um, seriously, everything in her shop is so magical. This is not sponsored or anything. She doesn't even know that I'm putting this in my video. I'm just excited about it. <laughs> and she makes really cute things and I just wanna see her do well. So first up, I got this. Oh, this is so awkward. Eh. I got this amazing broomstick necklace, which is actually the cutest thing I've ever seen. Just about. And then the other thing that I got from her, which if you're not seated, you might want to seat yourself because these are so cute. So cute. Little Disney inspired birds and they go on your collar or sweater. I guess you could do whatever you wanted with them. Which way do you guys go? And they just kind of make me feel like Snow White or Cinderella and I love them. Sometimes I feel like my button up blouses are a little bit boring up top. So this is gonna spice it up. That was my salt bay impression. Last but not least are these adorable shoes, which very, very sadly don't fit me. They are way too skinny for my feet. Um, I think I got my foot like this far into it before I was like, nope. Picture Cinderella's stepsisters trying to fit their feet into the glass slipper. I will probably end up selling these because again, they are beautiful. Gosh darn it, they just don't fit. And that is it. I am very excited about all my purchases and feels good to treat yourself. Gosh darn it. I definitely suggest treating yourself at least once a month because you deserve it. And again, I just wanna let you guys know that I love you and I thank you for watching. Uh, okay. I love you guys, and I will see you in the next video. Bye! You know, my neighborhood is the most quiet neighborhood in the world, but today, it's like a parade. Go cool, make sure you're still recording. Okay, okay you are. That's good. Ow! And all that jazz. And all that jazz we're gonna I gotta stop saying that. And all that jazz you gotta will the show things I bet he's talking down. And all that jazz. The quality content you subscribe for, right? Mm.